Good evening. It's 6.13 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Friday, January 18th, 2019. Let's take another look at Litecoin. Looks like they're trying to keep the high price. If you notice, we're just being hammered down. Since January 16th, you can see the highs are getting lower and lower. You see, this is how they're manipulating the price down. They're going against the actual flow of the market. Let's see where the, and they're using the sell walls and sell and buy wall for 2500 You see at 3124 it's been lowered down. And the buy wall, that's at 3049 Both of them for 2500 Go check my last videos. These are manipulation kettling walls. Uh... A lot of people will say, well, uh, uh, that's really an assumption. Uh, it's not an assumption when a simple thing like this is just as easy to me as adding 2 plus 2 together. It's very obvious. It's not an assumption. All right? I heard that nonsense too much before. You know, you know if you can't recognize a pattern or you know, if you can't recognize manipulation trades in an order book, don't, don't trade. And don't come to people with stupidity saying, oh, it's just an assumption. It, it's not. I've been in this business 25 years. And if you don't understand, go buy a book that says the 28 signs of manipulation in any stock market and kettle and trades and price fixing using two large walls to buy and sell is one of the paragraphs in the book. You got to understand, these guys at Coinbase should be locked the F up. Look at this. I, 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 hear, I hear this stuff. Oh, it's only assumption. No, it's not. Go. I got 136 videos of the manipulation. 136 videos showing that this 2,500 for the past almost two months has never been bought or sold and just adjusted in the range of the order book to manipulate it. So all those critics out there, don't open up your mouth if you don't know what you're talking about. It's embarrassing. You embarrass yourself in front of the whole world. Look at this. The same 2500 that was a higher price just every single day. And they keep lowering it and lowering it down to manipulate the price. And then I have people making stupid comments. Stupid, uneducated, dumbass comments. They have no clue. Manipulation was in the book in front of them. They're so idiotic, quick to open their mouth, that they can't even recognize. It's just simple watching numbers. God, people just really piss me off sometimes. If you're that stupid, keep your mouth shut and watch and listen and learn. Sorry for the rest of you people out there, but somebody made a, 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 a snarky remark that after I've been watching this and reporting it since September of 2017, that it's an assumption. When dozens of you could, uh, actually were the ones that guided to me, and dozens of other people besides myself who probably have more experience than I do confirmed what I say is true. This is why this is why the um, manipulators get away from get away with stuff like this because we have too many bumpkins in here who if you if, if you if you show them the largest buy and sell wall of the same market size and they never bought or sold can't figure out why they're there in the book. Other words, they can't read. Johnny can't read. It's pitiful. It's really pitiful. Now I've been t I've been able to call out when the market is dropped. You look at one of them; they're going to push this price down. 
I'm telling you on January 15th, what happens a couple of hours later, boom, they drop the price down. They're not going to let this price go up because they don't have plans to let it go up. See? See? Two, the two largest walls in the exposed order book that never leave, they never bought, they never sold. All they do is move along the price line, manipulating the price. How do they manipulate the price? Because with both of these two, that they put up the same walls on both sides, the same market size, to obscure their influence on the volume, which they're not supposed to be doing. That's number one. Number two, they're using the pressure of the two largest walls in the book to influence the price. It's, it's, it's simple. It's very simple. But for some reason, simple to some people, oh, you're just assuming. Of course you think I'm just assuming. You're too stupid to realize what's going on in the order book. It might as well be friggin' showing fire to a caveman. <gasps> oh my god. People, please. If you don't know what you're talking about, don't make me have to embarrass you. A ask a question. If you think I'm assuming stuff, I'll sit here and talk to you, walk you through this, and explain everything to you. I'll even show you the information that shows me how this. I know this is a kettle and trade. Uh, uh, the, the people make comments that are very childish like that when I'm trying to help people. Because, you know, when they use the kettle and trade, let me explain something to you. When they, when they control of the price of a commodity or stock within the price range and they restrict it from going up and down a certain way, if you're not smart enough to understand or you think you're uh, this have I gone shorter or, or you think you're the top line shorter or stuff, when they block this block, put a large sell wall on the buy side lower, they're blocking you from making a potential profit when you're short. And then this wall over there blocks the people that are trying to make money go along. So you're not winning, you're in the losing situation as well. They're just lowering the price so they can acquire the coin on the cheap. So please, people, don't. Do not make stupid comments if you don't obviously understand anything. If you don't know how to read an order book, don't say you know everything about the order book when you can't even open up the first page and understand what's going on. So again, the books are being manipulated using two large walls and pushing those walls up and down. The price lane puts pressure on the market. They're using the volume of their trades to control the price. This is basic 101 manipulation trading. That's all it is. I don't have time to, to argue with income poops. But if you ask me and you don't know, because maybe you don't have any experience, I will help you. But do not come here arrogant and tell me I don't know what I'm, I'm talking about and you know less than I do. All right, people. Coinbase needs to be dragged. These guys need to tell you in the street. These guys dragged everybody to the gutter, and they need to be have to be treated just the same as everybody else. These guys at Coinbase are, are, are thieves.